Hello from the northwestern part of Spain, Galicia with its strong Celtic roots. We're at the Estadio Abanca Baraidos. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Celta Vigo facing Getafe. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. for Celta Vigo. Nicolas Otamendi plays alongside Jason Denier in central defence and it's Patrick Sheik up front. The initial 11 then for Hitafe. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation but played well it can be really effective and key to its success are the wide midfield players. They have to be fit, they need to be able to run with the ball, and they need to double up with their fullbacks. It's a really tough role for them. And this confrontation is underway. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. gone in the game was firmly in their hands now though they've got to make sure they don't let this slip Forsberg long way out this oh that is a goal from long range he won't soon forget absolutely right out of the top drawer Well, look at the replay here, because they don't come much better than this. He hits it so sweetly. What a goal this is. It is a decent-looking attack here. Might jump in front. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Short corner routine. Munir. Can he finish here? It should be. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. Still pressing for an equaliser.
They are a goal down, but perhaps a chance to create something from this corner. And over it comes. And did his job defensively. Firing it towards goal. Terrific block. Martinez. And now with Rui Diaz. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, we touched on it before the game. They've got too many players who run faster going forward than they do when they're running back towards their own goal. And that's been the problem again today. Their recovery runs are far too slow.